Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Sunday morning, and I'm in the car here waiting on Gina uh, before we go to church. I like to come out here a little early and get the car turned around for her so she can uh, get parked close to the door so she don't have to walk through the grass to get her dress shoes all dirty or whatnot. And sometimes I'll turn, if it's cold enough, I'll turn the heat on in her seat so her little booty don't get cold or whatever. So I do things like that because I'm, I'm considerate and I love her and she loves me. But, you know, sometimes we... We just miscommunicate a little bit, and so she's uh, a little mad about me about some miscommunication yesterday, and and um, so I wanted to share that with you about you know how you need to talk, how you need to explain things to your wife when you're out shopping, and you know as I think more about this, I think about what my daddy told me when he was on his deathbed. You know, he looked me in the eye and he said, "Son, there's three things that you should never get mad about." And I remember these things, and I'll take them to my deathbed. You know, he told me, he said, number one, he goes, don't ever get mad at your pallbearers if they don't show up at your funerals on Super Bowl Sunday. He goes, number two, don't ever get mad at your wife if you take her shopping and there's some miscommunication about what's going on. And number three is you got to, um, oh, shoot, what was number three? I don't remember number three. But anyway, here's what happened. Our standard, our standard is we're going to go to the Rule King. We're probably going to eat at the Chick-fil-A. We're probably going to do something with the Hobby Lobby. That's kind of our standard, right? So I get in this routine. Well, yesterday we go to an outlet. And we're at this outlet. And we've been there probably, probably two hours, something like that. And I'm ready to go. And so I'm like, well, I wonder where she's at or whatever. And I look down, finally my phone rings, right? And I look down. Uh, by the way, I've got a, the Wonder Woman theme song is her ringtone on her on my phone. Well, I look down and sure enough, it's Gina calling me. And she was like, where are you at? And I said, hey, baby, you remember, you remember about three years ago uh, we were at this outlet. I think it was three years ago we were at this outlet and you were, we were at this jewelry store and you were at the, you were like, hey, you know, I really like this ring, and uh, it's real pretty, and I was like, oh, you know, that's so nice, and maybe one day I can get it for you, you know, remember that jewelry store, and she was like, oh, yes, I remember, and I was like, well, I'm at the gun store right beside it, and man, she hung up on me, y'all believe that, she hung up on me, and so I'm now I'm at the mall trying to figure out the outlets, trying to figure out where she's at, you know. But anyway, so she we eventually we'll get it worked out, bless her heart. But uh, you know, you gotta communicate. You gotta communicate on how they communicate. So that's a lesson learned for all you youngins out there. So I should have known better. I as a as a veteran married guy, I should have known better. So I'll chalk this one up to me, okay? But anyway, hey you guys, I'll talk to you next Sunday.